Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Technocuts. In today's video, we will discuss about the barcode reader interface with FX5 PLC. Here we will use FX5232 BD card mounted over top of FX5 PLC. So let's get started. First I will go to the module parameter section on the bottom left. Then I will click the expansion board. So we will select RS2 RS232 and uh, BD card here and uh, the communication protocol type will be non-procedural click ok click yes then we have data length parity stop bit and bond rate that will be according to your barcode scanner header terminator all the setting if you want to use you can use but make sure that the same setting is uh, in the barcode scanner okay so all this is the setting part now let's move to the programming section so the instruction what we'll, we will be using will be RS2 instruction so I will use M1 as a bit and uh, I will use RS2 so the first parameter here will be send data that means D you can use D100 uh, and D0 will be your data length that you need to send then you have the received data that will be D200 and the um, 6 can be your data length you want to receive then this is the channel number so i am using k2 so why i am using k2 i will show you so this is your send data send data length this is receive data receive data length Okay. So, so the reason I use K2 here is because as per the manual, if you look at the RS232 BD card, that FX5-232 BD card, it says that it has to be used in channel number uh, as K2. Whereas if you talk about the inbuilt port of FX5U, that is uh, our RS, RS485 port, that is for K1, that is for channel number 1. So for channel number two, when we are using 232 BD card, we will use K2. Okay. Now let's move to the manual here. Here in manual, uh, uh, we have this operation data flag for all channels that is given. So if you are using send data, you need to send some data. Then you need to trigger this M SM8572. But now, but here we are not using uh, data to be sent. So what we'll use is we will only have to receive the data from the barcode scanner. So we will use SM8572. Okay. So SM8572. So this is your receive completion flag for channel number two. What we will do here is we will receive the data in D200, whatever the data length is. Okay. And then we will transfer the data when it is received from D200 to any other register like I will use block move let's move D200 to suppose D500 and the length is uh, let's say 20 so it is our data processed or you can say data is okay so okay 20 okay now what happen will be if I turn on the M1, M1 is on and we receive any data in D200 or barcode is scanned. You must enter some value here in D6 because you will not receive any data if you haven't uh, used this da data length you want to receive. Like suppose it is the value here is 20. So I can uh, receive the length up to 20. So when the data is received, we will get this SM8572 flag on and we will just transfer D200 to D500. Okay. So this is how you can communicate your barcode scanner with your FX5 PLC using 232BD card. So if you like my video, please like and subscribe. Thank you.